Congratulations, Mr. Potter. You completed the challenge. You've collected all the challenge stars. Well, if Don't I got all the challenge stars, I'm happy with that. Now off you go. Yep. See, uh... Oh, man, I'm gonna miss Mrs. Sprout. She's like one of the very few cool. Attend the second ground... What'd that say? Uh, I believe that said, like, attend second ground flying lessons or something like that. I'm like, what the hell? Oh, forget it. Let's just go. Is there going to be that weird thing where there's beans here all of a sudden now, again? Yeah, there is. Look, it just doesn't make any sense. Last time I came here, no beans. I come here again, beans. I don't, I don't get it. Did, like, the fucking bean fairy just come across this land? No, it's probably the Easter Bunny. He's just, like, shitting out beans everywhere. What an asshole. God, I don't like that guy. Well, if we're attending flying lessons, we probably have to head out this way, right? Uh, right, Mr. Slytherin guy? Or, yeah, yeah, Slytherin guy. Off the broomstick training, Potter. Don't be late. This is broomstick training, right? Or not. Okay, this is, like, for the advanced son of a bitches. Fine. This is, this is for the cool kids, apparently. What the hell is this? Oh, it's still Batman Forever, okay. I, I was a little confused there. Oh man, the movie's almost over. Shit, what comes on after Batman Forever? Probably nothing. Oh! You only lived twice. Well, eh. That's not a great eh. I've seen that James Bond movie too much. Oi. Comedy Central, what do you got? Still Balls of Fury, son of a bitch. Well, I got nothing. Um... Do do do. How about Animal Planet? What's Animal Planet got? Oh, Cat from Hell. Okay, sure. I'll throw that on. My computer screen kind of blocks it, the freaking monitor anyway. So there you Who are. cares? I hope you did well in your herbology class. Oh yeah, I did I've awesome, got Hagrid. I need to talk to you about. Be best to discuss it back at my hut. Meantime, you're gonna be late for your broomstick training. Off oh no! Oh damn it! I gotta do that now, don't I? Fuck! There's so much shit you have to do before you go to the 5th. I forgot about that. Well, at least task number 1 isn't too bad. Let's go to Broomstick Glass, which is actually over here. Oh, hey, it's Ron. Here comes Neville. He looks quite upset. Best go and see what he wants. He's probably upset because you were running me. away from him, you asshole. So Longbottom has gone sliver into you, and you want me to give you his precious Remembrol. I think I'll leave it somewhere for Longbottom to come. How about up a tree? <laughs> <laughs> I just come realized on, that sounded just like the girl from uh friggin' uh God damn it, what is it? Uh Garbage Pail Kids movie. Like the girl sh whatever fuck her name was, the girl who looked like a birthday present. Think you catch me? Come on then, Potter. Oh, yeah, I kind of uh, skipped that because I was too busy laughing at this stupid laugh. Remember all, Chase. Knock my foot off his broom until he returns to Devil on Bottoms. Remember all. See, what I didn't understand about this part was Give why was Malfoy chasing Malfoy. after Neville? You want the Remember all back? See if you can catch it. All right, and well. You better, uh, watch out for my you better watch out for me, gonna come kick your ass. Okay, what the hell's the speed up button again? Is it left stick? Yeah, there we go. Get the fuck back here. Whoa! Get the fuck out of here! Yeah, this part's really not that bad. You just have to go fast and pretty much catch up to this asshole. Don't bump in the walls, otherwise you'll die. That was an awful shot, Mr. Malfoy. Get the fuck back here. <laughs> you just got fucked! Man, I never did that fast. Potter, you'll pay for this. Here, take this stupid thing. I've no use for it. Yep. What the hell? Did it, like hit me in the face? Find Hagrid's hut. So apparently he had no faith in us because he just walked back inside the castle and did whatever the hell he did. You've got my remember all back. Thanks, Harry. I'll be able to find my toad now. Okay. Come here, Trevor. Come back. I remember now. I left Trevor near the herbology class. There are plants there that eat toads. 
I eat toads all the time, like all those chocolate frogs. Mm, those things are yummy Mr. as shit. Potter, I'm Professor actually, that uh, actually sounds Deputy pretty disgusting. I really don't want to eat a chocolate and frog. Head of Gryffindor House. Although I do not approve of your chasing Malfoy about, oh, I shut up. you have remarkable talent on a broomstick. A remarkable skill Ordinary, holding the left click button. First year students may not compete in Quidditch. In your case, we might overlook that rule. Harry, oh, gee. Gryffindor's first Quidditch match of the year is later this afternoon against the formidable Slytherin team. Why well, don't even know See how the then. fuck to play it? Okay, you just uh, you just go off then. Great. Good to know I know how to play. You don't even want to help me practice then? Dumb broad. All right, time to go over to Hagrid's hut. Where the fuck is Hagrid's hut at? God damn it, I don't remember. Um, it's probably off to this way. Yeah. Okay, yep, this is probably it. Can I actually hit this again? Or could I hit this to begin with? No, I couldn't. Oh, forget it. Just go. So we actually go get to do another annoying part of this game. What a surprise. There's so many of them. Forest Edge. Find Hagrid's hut. Find two secret wizard cards. Find seven secret areas. Yes, there's multiple parts to this. Oh, man, it gets so damn annoying. First off, you have to go to Hagrid's hut. Which is obviously the hardest fucking thing to do. Why is there so many damn obstacles to get there? It's really ridiculous. The fact that they put all this shit in the way to get to Hagrid's hut. Literally in the Chamber of Secrets, it's like two steps. And then you're friggin' there. But in this game, nope, nope. You gotta go through hell and high water just to get there. Literally, high water. Also, we can see our good friends, the, uh, the farting turtles. Uh, where the hell are the farting turtles at? I will get to see him in a bit. Can I climb up this? No, I cannot. Um, defender that. That's what I need to do. And... Now what? Ah, I see. Well, before I climb up there, let's take care of those things. Why don't we? Ow, okay. He aimed it downward at me. What a bitch. I don't like this guy. Well, if you can aim it downward, let's see you aim it upward then, you stupid plants. Heh <laughs> yeah. There's no way he'll aim it upwards. Oh man, but now I have to aim downwards. This is awkward. And that Alahamor once again turned into an incendio. I'd love to kill one of the plants with the Alahamor. That'd be hilarious. Like, opens up their guts. <laughs> You know what, that would, that would actually be a very devastating spell. That's probably a forbidden spell, like forbidden spell number four. It's just no one ever uses it. It's like Alahamora <laughs> on, on a human, not on a lock. It just opens them up from the inside. That, that would be a very, very painful spell. Because literally, the, the, the friggin, oh, whatever they're called, uh, god damn it. The unallowed spells are very stupid. Barely do anything that threatening. Like, whatever Voldemort has, the uh, Avadika Davish, the thing that sounds like a racial slur from the Middle East, uh, that that really doesn't do anything. All it does is send out a green stream. It's like, basically, it's like shooting off a gun. So what the hell is the difference? Why not just take a gun and go on a killing spree, Mr. Voldemort? The other one just makes uh, things like spaz out and like controls their body or something like that. I don't even remember what the third one is. They're just so unmemorable and unnecessary. Why even bother with them? Might as well use the other spells to kick ass. Like I'm sure there's a spell that casts fire. You can like burn someone alive. Why not use that? Why is that a forbidden spell? Ah, forget it. I don't even know why I'm complaining. Hello, snails. Um, Flipendo the tree. Got it. Well, that was simple. Oh, son of a doxy. Where the fuck are you? Get out of here. Um, where's the third one? Third one's back there. God damn it. Get over here. Gotcha. Stupid doxies. Give me that save game book. Give me that book. Woo! Okay, let's just continue onward as I watch this more boring animal planet, whatever shit they have on. Oh, cat from hell or whatever the fuck's called. 
Hmm. Let's also knock over that tree. Man, I really wish I could still cast stalls in midair, but of course I can't. I cannot. Let's grab that chocolate frog. In case you are a dumbass and do not know how to play the game very well, they give you chocolate frogs like mad. Okay then. Um And then the final boss ends up being like really friggin' hard. Well not that hard, but still, coming off everything else's difficulty, it's a son of a bitch. And there's no reason to go that path rather than this one. So I'm just going to continue along this way, and here we are. Oh man. Look how big those incendio plants are. Why did I pretendo that one? Oh, that's why. And it actually rotates that old log we had, remember? So now you can actually jump on top of the log. Can I actually go down? Kind of curious. Like, is there anything down there? There is nothing down there. That is a shame. Well then, um... Alright then. I'm just gonna continue. Going inside the log's not gonna do anything except get you killed. So don't do that. And across we go. We're actually using Incendio a lot more than I remember. Aim for that guy. Aim down, aim for that guy. I can kind of get like an aiming mode going. Ow. Son of a bitch. No, don't walk into his line of fire again. Yeah, I can kind of get an aiming mode if I use the mouse button, which I usually... Or not the mouse button, the mouse pad. Which I usually don't use. Oh shit, he's, he's waking up. Over the snail. There we go. Ow. Fucking plants. You know, why am I even bothering killing them all? Just kill enough... Okay, that's why I'm bothering to kill them all. To do asshole things like that. Oh, hey. There's actually a hidden path behind him. Awesome. I forgot about this hidden path. Let's actually go inside of it. This music's nice and serene, too. Oh, wait, no. That's the Google commercial. Damn it. The first second was actually having some really nice serene music for once. Nope, it, it was just the Google commercial, and now there's a car falling in water. What the hell? These commercials make no fucking sense. Can I jump in that water? Will that kill me? I'm gonna say that that would kill me. Okay then, yeah, let's uh, let's not do that. I rather don't want to get killed right now. And what's up here? That was an awkward climb. Keep on moving, keep on moving, hit the waterfall, over across, there we go. Wizard card? Indeed it is. It is wizard card. I don't really give a shit. And it looks like... I don't know. Who cares? Float in midair some more, Mr. Potter, and let's see if we can attack that waterfall. We cannot. No secret behind the waterfall. That is a shame. Well then. Disappointment says goodbye. Out the cave we go. Do, do, do. Do, do, do. And once we go back out the cave, we actually have to climb up one more step, and out we go. It is now time to head over to Hagrid's Hut, except one more thing. <laughs> yeah, I get sidetracked a lot. Hmm. How do we get up there? Hmm. Interesting. I actually don't know. How would I go about getting up there? Huh. How would I do something like that? Kinda like knock over a tree? Kinda like cover? No, I can't do that. Huh. There's actually beans up there. What do I do to get up there? Hmm. Interesting. Okay, I think I have an idea. So I actually have to go back inside this cave for this. I'm not sure, but I think there's actually a secret wall. I don't actually remember doing this, so let me see if I can get this correct. 
see if there's like a hidden wall somewhere. Sorry for wasting your time if I'm doing so, but uh, I'm rather curious. I definitely can't fall down there. There has to be something I can do, though. Hmm. Uh. What to do? Is there an invisible wall? Yeah, there is. So then there's no chance of getting over there. I'm not sure. I don't know. Is it over near where the waterfall is? Something like that? I don't know. I'm thinking of anything at this point. Keep going, Mr. Potter. Perhaps there is a secret yet. I can't fall in this water either. Hmm. I'm not sure. I don't know. How exactly do I get up there? Wait a minute, up there. Hold up. What is that up there? Nothing. Can I aim at the stalagmites? Will that work? No. <clears throat> I don't know. I really don't know. I'm kind of curious about getting up there, because I don't know what's up there. But... Do I jump up? No. Inside? No. How about over here? What the hell? It's like floating through the wall there. Yeah, something tells me there's nothing I can really do about that. Because I have no idea. Oh. Really? That's it? I just had to hit the three snails? Well, okay then. Um, that was sad. <laughs> really? That's all it took? Hitting the three fucking snails? Oh, boy. So if you actually go through here, huh, I do think I remember this now. Yeah, I do remember doing this. God damn it. Oi, what's in here? Yeah. It's all looking familiar now. Well, what is this wizard card? It is some ugly guy. Great. I always wanted one. I should probably be looking up these cards, shouldn't I? So I have a Stumbledore, I believe I saw Merlin, I know I saw her, and there's that asset. There's the guy, famous magical theoretician, there's that oddball guy, the guy who ate the spider, celebrated wizard of prison by Malchus for his writings. Okay, here's where it starts. 1897 to the present, celebrated author of Fantastic Beasts and Where to Find Them. Oh hey, I actually have that book. Uh, I'm not joking. There literally was a book released on that, and you actually, uh, you can actually buy it. Edgar Stroger, Strogler, I don't know. 1703 to 1798. Inventor of the Sneakoscope. Okay. Bowman Wright, 1492 to 1560. Famous for development of the Golden Snitch. Godric Gryffindor, medieval wizard, dates unknown. Co-founder Hogwarts gave his name to one of the four Hogwarts houses. I believe I already saw that one. And it looks like there's this one. Herpo the Fell, ancient Greek, first known creator of the basilisk. Uh <clears throat> okay, that's uh that's fantastic. Off we go then. <clears throat> Why do I keep coughing? I don't know. Okay, off we go. Do do do. Hagrid I fucking hate this part. Can I do something over here, or do I just have to go over to... Yep, I just have to go over and see Hagrid. Collect the fire seeds. Find two secret wizard cards, find eight secret areas. Oh, oh, oh this part's so boring. Right, so, over here. are you ready to know why we have to collect fire seeds? Well, Hagrid's going to explain. 
by the way, congratulations on making the Quidditch team. Word travels fast round Hogwarts. How? You get lost so easily in that damn place. Ah, oh, forget it.